Hello, welcome to my channel. Today, let's make something easy, simple, and fun. Okay, I'm gonna show you how to make a bed. Maybe a low poly or high poly. Well, let's make low poly first. Okay, so let's delete the light. I prefer just hide it. And the camera, let's hide it. And then here's the default cube. Press one and end. Okay, I'm a little bit too slow today. Go to edit, auto mirror, auto mirror, guys. Your best friend very useful okay something like that go to edit mode scale it to the z this is going to be the bed frame maybe a little bit more okay and then scale it to the um, press one first okay and scale that to the y i don't know how long your bed is but uh, it actually depends on you how you want to make your bed so you got something like that. That's gonna be the bed frame. And I think I'm gonna make it even thinner. Scale it to the Z. Make it even thinner. Don't worry, it won't break. I promise you that. It won't break. <laughs> now let's add another cube. This is gonna be the the legs. Scale it to the Z. Scale me scale it again. And make it longer. Doesn't matter how long you want. But it depends on you. Depends on you. If you want it high, then go high. If you want it to be low, then go low. Okay. And got something like that. Wrap that to the over here. Doesn't doesn't have to be middle or something. And let's let's uh, scale this one. Okay. And now let's uh, mirror this thing. Nice mirror. Mirror just this one. Okay. Now we get that mirrored. Let's add another mirror again. Another mirror. This time it's this one, but we're gonna face to the Y, I believe. Ah, yes. To the Y. There, there you go, guys. That's a bed frame for now. And uh, I would say that it looks like a table. And well, congratulations. You just make yourself a table. But that's not what we're gonna make, okay? We're gonna make a bed. Now for this one, let's, I mean, I should edit this one first, instead of adding the leg. But that's completely up to you, which part do you want first, and which part would you like to do. It should be the same. It's true, that is it. Okay. Let's grab it again. Let's make it rounder. Grab this one. I don't know if that's round or that's too sharp. But once we add the subdivision service on it, it's gone, okay? So you got the first bed frame over there. Let's add some few details. Now we don't need it. If you want, you can add, okay? Now let's make the, what do you call it? Something that we are lying on bed. The mattress? Is it the mattress? The mat? Yeah. Let's do that. Cube. For there, press one scale. You can duplicate this one actually, but I'm showing you adding a few more stuff would be fun. <laughs> scale shift Z. Oh, I, I accidentally turned it to wireframe. Okay, scale shift Z. Something over there doesn't have to be that perfect. And let's scale that to the Y. Okay. Scale it again because I, I think this is gonna be a little bit offset. There you go. Okay. Scale it to the Y. Okay, let's see now. It's a little bit offset. Maybe I'm gonna grab this a little bit back to the back. Grab this to the Y. Okay. Press L now. Let's see if it's, I think it's overlapping. Yep, it's overlapping. Let's grab that. Will we get that in the top? Okay, grab it. Oh, it's gonna be very hard. Let me zoom. Let me zoom out a little bit. Yeah, it's still overlapping a little, but let's try it again. I'll select that one only. 
Oh, whatever. We can fix that later. <laughs> okay, so we get ourselves a comfortable blocky matrix there. Let's add a pillow. Use this one, okay? Just reuse your reuse your uh, your mesh, okay? Rotate that to the Z ninety degree. Press seven. Go to upper view. Scale. I don't know how many pillow you want, but that's completely up to you. Again. <laughs> Wrap it to Z. Oh, let me zoom that. Wrap it over there. A little bit more, Grab. yeah, something like that. Okay, right. that could be your pillow, very big, not comfortable, something. Yeah, that could be a, make it a little bit. Okay, so you have your bed there. Now, for the last part, which I think is a blanket. This is the blanket, I'm going to use the plane. Okay, that's your blanket there. I'm thinking I'm going to scale. Scale that to the Y, I'm going to make it long. Grab that to the, over there. Let's see here. Okay. So I'm not going to say that I'm going to just go over there and it's through there and through there, okay? I'm going to just... Leave it like that because I'm gonna show you something else later. Okay, I'm gonna hide this first. Let's up, let's uh, add some subdivision surface on each of these. If you want, you can use the bevel as well. Go over here, add the modifier subdivision surface. I think it should go to this one first. And uh, bevel subdivision surface. Hmm, that's completely weird. There. Let's go add some leaf cuts. Okay. This one goes here. And let's bring this one up over here. Another one here. And this one. Not that there are lots of way to uh, making your bed, okay? Now let's go to this one. We have the mirror there. I'm gonna leave it. If you want to leave it, leave it. I think I'm gonna apply it first. Call A to apply. Make sure in object mode. Call A to apply. So we get this old one. Subdivision surface on it. Render. Oh. Why am I what did I apply? Now this is gonna be nightmare. <laughs> Just them. Okay, this is not a this is not a good habit, but if you have no choice and you don't want to go back, well, let's do it like that. Just do it like this, okay? Let's see now. I think I can bring the leg a little bit up. Something like that. Okay. That's a quite high bed. Very risky. And let's use this one. Control Three, yes, because I think I have oh, is this three, three, or oh, this one is two, and go with three. Make it as smooth as I can. Okay, this one, the there, that, in the back, over there, grab it over there. Okay. I got something like that. I don't know if it's comfortable or not, but yeah, maybe you would buy it. And now for the pillow, control three. Oh, look at that. What happened to your pillow there? <laughs> so I'm gonna go to edit mode. Go right over there. Right over there. One. Scale this a little bit, or you can just grab this over here to make it round. And this one, this one, oh, this oh, better go to this one. Grab it up, make it look like a pillowish shape. Okay, now you got your pillow over there. And the fun part, 
let's use the plane bag and this one okay i'm gonna grab it up did we apply all of this yes we did maybe later we apply subdivision surface a few times doesn't matter how many you want completely up to you did i did i scale this oh i did i scale so i'm gonna add another one yep something like that it's not painted yet it should, should be fine now let's add the uh, some physics on this this is gonna be the the collision this is gonna be the plot okay then this one i believe and this i believe i'm gonna add a collision oh if rigid body no collision this one collision this one as well collision need to try let's grab it a little bit up let's see if it works yeah it really works guys it works <laughs> and I, I think the blanket's going to fail see that <laughs> but that looks cool yo but one thing you need to need to add is this go to i think it's the collision right ah yes in the collision enable the self collision of weight Nah, not the collision. This one go to here. Enable the self collision. Okay. Now let's see it again. I just want it like. Ah, I just want it like that. Okay. That's all I wanted. Very cool, right? Let's shade smooth. Before we do that, let's add some solidify on it. Let's do it again. We have add the solidify. I think that's too thick, yo. Just want it like that, a thin one. Yes, that's what you want. Pulse there. So we just stop over there. That's only the frame we need. Let's enable the. We have the self collision there. No problem. Let's apply the solidify first. Control A. Oh, that's a bad idea. Try the plot first and apply the solidify. Let's shade smooth. Why is it like that? Well, because maybe it doesn't have enough subdivision. And now you just shade smooth so that's no problem at all. Okay? And let's do the same applying. Collision, let's apply the collision. This one. Okay, I believe I apply all those modifier. Let's see if we miss something. Nope, we didn't miss. Oh, this one we miss. Control A to apply. Okay, you got something like that. Let's shade smooth them all. Shade smooth. This one too. Shade smooth. Shade smooth, pillow, shade smooth, this one, wet frame. And look what you just made. Just make a bed. Very <laughs> cool, right? Okay, let's go shade it. I'm going to turn this into something like woody shape. Maybe this one. There one, a little bit dark wood. And I don't need the specular. Maybe I need just a little bit, but I don't need the roughness. I just want the specular. And for this one, hmm, it's up to you how you want it. I'm gonna make it a little bit darker because uh, they don't wash it. That's how. And this one, the pillow, same color like this one. Ah, uh -huh, that one. And a blanket, you can choose anything you like. I'm gonna go with, well, blue blanket, red. I'm gonna go with red blanket. And the specular, I don't need that, and I don't want to be that plastic. Okay. Let's go there. Let me see. Okay. Oh, I forgot about the lid. Let me give you the same color as the the body. 
all right so that's how i make my bed guys uh you can uh you can try this you can try making this one too it's very fun and good to learn so do anything you like okay so that's all for today thanks for watching and i'll see you next time on the next story okay now happy blendering bye now